Okay, so as we look at inverse functions, um, the notation of arc sine or arc cosine or arc tan, whatever, and sine inverse mean exactly the same thing. So make sure you understand that these are identical. They're just different notation to get the same thing. And what they're um, looking for is they're looking for an angle, right? They give you the angle. So if what you're looking for is the angle, then you need to use one of these functions. And it's just simply saying, um, so if I give you something like um, root 3 over 2, and I want to know sine inverse of root 3 over 2, I go to my circle, um, and I notice that um, root 3 over 2 is at 60 degrees. So if you look at your unit circle, I want you to notice a couple things. This is positive. Um, and also for sine, I am limited to quadrants. Um, if I look at my unit circle like this, um, sine and tangent are limited to these two, these two term, these two um, quadrants. So sine and tangent have to be in within quadrants one and quadrants uh, four, and cosine is in quadrants one and quadrants two. So um, cosine is the top half of the circle and sine and tangent are this side of the circle, the right side of the circle. Okay, um, and the only other thing that I want to mention is if um, you go, let me do another page here. If you go, oops, if you, um, if I'm asking for like, um, let's say arc tan of negative one. So arc tan of negative one, if I look at my unit circle, is going to be um, down here. First of all, I want you to notice that it's negative, so I'm going to be in the fourth quadrant, right? Tangent is negative here, it's positive in the first quadrant. And um, root 2 over 2, and um, negative root 2 over 2, anything over itself, right? Sine over cosine is negative, is, um, is, itself, is 1, sorry, so negative root 2 over 2 divided by root 2 over 2 is just going to be 1, and because I have 1 negative, it's negative. So, however, this is the one little thing you have to be careful of. Um, because I want to stick in the fourth quadrant, I have to go, I have to give that negative angle. I cannot start here and give this positive angle. I don't want that blue angle. I want the red one. So this is going to be, so I don't want to say 315 degrees. I, my answer is actually negative 45 degrees. So arc tan of negative 1 is negative 45 degrees.